Hello and thank you for being here. And now for something completely different. Well, maybe just a little bit different. It's my first attempt at a, what they call, or used to call TV dinner. This is the, it's the um, steak, Salisbury steak, and mashed potatoes, green beans, and that right there is a brownie. That's really the main thing that interests me. It has some plastic on it, and I got confused about the instructions. I, I haven't fixed one like this before, like a, a TV dinner. This time I have my pepper also. I am a pepper, you're a pepper. Hungry Man, Salisbury Steak. Okay, it's uh, not particularly nutritious. Uh, the, the saturated fat, sodium, cholesterol, even the sugars are kind of problematic. But like I said, this is um, something I don't think I've ever... I think I fixed one or two. And that was a while ago, like a few years ago. Well, let's check it out. The baked potato, the um, mashed potato. Hmm. It could be a little warmer. And I cooked it for longer than it said. I put it in this gravy, see if that gets a little bit warmer. Mm hmm. That said to, um, he removed the film, but then uh, cut some little slits in the film, uh, in the little sheet there over the steak, but then remove the, the um, film from the, or the plastic from the brownie, the top of the brownie. I was a little bit confused by it. As always, whenever I fix something the first time, my goal is simply to not die. to not get sick. It's really tasty. Mm. As soon as you put the, the um, mashed potato in the gravy, it's nice and hot. And our beans. Beans are good. I mean, they do taste really good. Everything tastes really pretty good. I'm still experimenting with the vertical video. Yeah, these are quite tasty. I'm in the formal dining room, which is the most unused room in the house, I guess. I open the window a little bit to let some sh some sun in. What's that song from the 60s, the late 60s, by the, the fifth dimension? Let the sun shine, let the sun shine. Very 
very tasty steak. To say I'm very I'm very impressed. It's kind of easier to make videos, to make these kind of videos with the um, with the vertical. Because I don't have to be scrunched down like this to get the plate in if I'm making a horizontal horizontal video. Or maybe I'm just doing it wrong. I'm sure there's a way to do that. I just don't know what it is. And I've made a lot of videos. Feel like I'm eating a little bit too fast. But I wanted to finish this meal in this video. And I know after a few minutes people kind of tune out. At least most videos that I've that I've seen, that's what I do. So far I haven't found one thing that I dislike about this little meal, except the nutritional considerations. full. How can that be? I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. The problem with my potassium and my sodium. And that's one reason I quit making eating videos before. sure what I'll do about all of this. I'm not a mukbanger. I don't I believe that overeating is kind of I mean grossly overeating is kind of gross. So my meals will tend to be kind of small.
and hope you will subscribe, comment, share, and like. Sure, I can eat any more. Okay, rich chocolate brownie. It is rich, for sure. For sure. It is so good, too. I think I might even heat this up for supper with something else. Maybe a little salad. And I hope you enjoyed the video and, and I hope you're doing well and safe and happy. And we'll talk again later. I promise.